My people, how on a day? Salute on according to na time. Well, depending on where on a time that they're listening to us, my people. On a welcome to this obongalistic day with another obonga information. My people, no be smart, you know. On a don here, you the Dutch lawyer. You don't advise some who say it's better as everything day now. Making go submit to the court by himself. Say in the accept the divorce. Say in the accept the divorce. So we we may file for say he don't consent to granting him granting her the divorce. Say you know they dispute it again. No? Because say now the only way way he go better for him. Because as he did now, with all the analysis of the case from the beginning till now, with how everything don't happen, and with the situation of things now, say the case is going towards main line. And uh, if the court by themselves declare the divorce, so it could be a shameful thing to him, one. And also, it could be like, say, him, everybody could begin to drag him and uh, the failure in Ogo good. So, but if he go to court, say he's tired of all these things and uh, say all these things where they happen, no be in mind. So now this woman carry the case go to court. So even though him no day interested in divorcing the woman, but if that's the woman, if that's what the woman want, because he's someone we in like so much, so he no go like deny him of waiting in like. Since now she by herself say he want divorce, so there's nothing he can do because when somebody don't reject you, what you go do? So you make him just go there. Tell them, say, he's doing it out of love. He's doing it out of his own benevolence. Nobody say he's done him will. But there's nothing again he can do other than to grant her what she wants because she always like her to have what she wants. Say, that will be a prestigious way of ending this whole thing because definitely, definitely, the whole thing is ending. The whole thing is ending. So that the only thing he has to do is to take it, take the initiative to agree Instead of letting it not be that you are dragging and dragging until the court will start reading the reason why, reading all the judgment of the violence, all the judgment of this and that. Because as soon as you say this, all those things will not be read again. And if those things were not read again, there will be no charges against you because you have already granted her onto what she wants. And anytime, if the, the court now begins to read the charges, say him now will not be asking for mercy. Tampa justice with mercy because you have already granted her what she needs. And uh, the next thing is that you cannot do any other thing since you have already accepted to give her what she needs. Because the charges that will come after the judgment, because definitely the court will grant divorce. That one is sure, banker is sure that definitely, definitely, the, your wife will get her divorce, you know, granted to her by the court because every evidence is there. I don't know what you did in the past and I don't know what you and your first lawyer did that you people allow this opponent, you are your opponent to have so much evidence. I mean, so much evidence that the evidences I see in court marvel me that you can't even contest any of them. They are all real. They are all real and certified real and certified evidence. So I think the only thing to do to have a soft landing is for you to go to court and uh, grant that. So you, Leduce, was telling the lawyer that right, 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 say no go feed one. How you go, go grant me? Say make him go. Say no. Is there no way where you go tell the court at least make something came from me? To, because if you grant her divorce now, she will go with everything. What about the house that there's a restriction on? We built together. And the lawyer told him that uh, there's no problem about the house. There's no problem because as soon as you say you want to do the divorce, the court will now look into the property in the family and uh, including the picking them that come from the family, the property that is in the family. And no, because everything needs to be shared. But there are still ways that court look at those things before it's shared. They will look at how it's built, who own the ownership of the thing, because you can't share what does not belong to the family. If the if they house belongs to you and hers, then it will be looked into know how it will be shared. For the sake of the picking, the, the court can decide, okay, because this woman is going and the picket that will be under her care, then she should go with the mansion. Or if it's a senator, it's okay, it should be divided like this. If the picket that will be divided and trained. So there are so many things. It's not what you wish that the court will do. Everything has a way of doing it. Even uh, the picking that will also be shared. 
the responsibility of the picket then would also be shared depending on who is working and who is not working depending on who earns more and who earns less so is these things are not what you do with your mind and it's not a traditional thing it is a legal thing and it has a standard of everything don't kept there that in a situation like this how many properties do you have registered in your name as a family what and what belongs to you how many houses do you have how many cars do you have how many lands do you have? You know, these properties should be stipulated, should be spelled out where it and how you got them, meaning to show evidence that those things belong to you. If you have evidence that those things belong to you, there's no problem they will be shared, unless they are not yours. But right now you are claiming the mansion, and May is claiming that the mansion belongs to her and their sister that you didn't even contribute anything. I don't know how that one would do. But the court, after so much interrogation about, you know, I've not been involved in the discussion about their house. I've only read what was said. It was not completely done. The questioning and everything had not finished. So if the property is just your problem, that one is not a, a, an issue. It is not something you tell the lawyer or the court what to do. It is something that the court already knows what to do about such situation because this is what the court has been managing for years. The issue of divorce is not a big issue, it's a small issue, only that if you keep yourself well, if you, that's what I always advise men, when you marry, try to know how you, uh, you know, keep yourself, prepare yourself, because you have to also prepare for eventualities because you don't know anything can happen. Anything can happen to any of you, something will happen. So. You have to prepare for the divorce. You have to prepare in case it happens. You have to prepare for you know, tomorrow. So if you didn't do that, the court will still look at all you have. If you, are actually, if you actually know how many plots of land you have, how many houses and mansions or whatever you call it you have, you actually know how many uh, 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 picking them you have and how many... Uh, amount you have in the financial your bank account, I mean the amount that belongs to both of you that you have in your bank account, that one is not a problem. Everything will be looked into, analyzed and look at the responsibilities, the investment will be looked into, the responsibility to have, the maintenance of the picking them and everything. You look into all of them and know how many, what and what to do. So that issue of property you've been talking about, unless this one is shared, unless this one is shared, it's not left for you to do that. It is what the court will decide. The court knows how to share it. The court knows what to do. And the court will definitely do the right thing. You know, no matter how you shout, no matter how you talk, the court will definitely do the right thing because the court knows the right thing to do. So it's not, you don't need to be saying, what about this, what about, because when you say it, you are just showing your mediocrity that you don't know what we're talking about. Because as long as you are in the court, for, even if you don't mention the property, as soon as the court grants your wife divorce, which they are definitely going to grant her, as soon as they grant her divorce, the next thing the court will look to is the property of the family. What and what do the family have? How will it be shared? Who gets who? Who, get what, who gets what? And who loses what? Because there are standards of sharing those things the court knows. You are not the one to tell the court. The court will only ask you a question, you answer, and the court will do it. So this is what the lawyer, you, the Duce lawyer, is explaining to you, Leduce. And you, Leduce, was like, how possible it is, and uh, that she will not, that he will not agree if the court does not share the thing well, that he would put appeal. And the lawyer was also laughing at him and telling him that I can now see why this case has gotten rotten like this, because you have never been showing prudence in everything. This is not a case of tradition where you can go and talk to people behind and they change what they want to say. This is a legal issue where the law is being followed, where issues are followed legally and according to how it's supposed to be. So it's not something you just go, okay, let's go behind and do this. Okay, let's go and meet. The, you don't go to magistrate house and meet magistrate, magistrate because the magistrate will come to court and say something or the judges out and meet judges or the lawyers. Even if you have... The only thing you can do is to meet the other legal team of the opponent, which will make the opponent to, you know, reduce their charges and everything. If not, the law, even when the lawyer there is not doing the right thing, somebody come from the crowd can still defend and add. And they, if the client, the owner of the case says, yes, I want the person to support, the person can support. So these are things that is done rightly. It's not, it's not something you say, I want it this way, I want it. Just, just, just don't disturb yourself about how you want it or just go to the court, the best thing you have to do for yourself is to go to court 
and tell the court, the first question they ask you that day is that whatever they ask you, just tell the court that I'm done with this case. I don't want to move further. I want to give her, I want to. I want her to go. She says she wants to go. Just allow her to go. Since she's the one that I didn't want, and I've dragged this case over a year now for her not to go, and she insists that she wants to go. Why should I be dragging her back? Let her go. Let her have her freedom. I think that's what she's looking for, so that I can also have my own freedom. I can also leave, instead of us to be running around the court every time, running around the case every time, running around everything. So it doesn't make any sense. Nobody's benefiting. So let her go. I think if you do that, you will change them. That's the worst, the only way and the best way to, to get the heart of the judge softened. Because they will see that, ah, this man is looking for peace. So what are we going to do? Let's see how we can assist him, you know, get a soft landing. So that is what you, the Duce lawyer, is telling. But the challenge... I, the challenge there now is my people. Will you, Ledoche, listen to the lawyer? Is he the first lawyer? The, the former lawyer that left him this, advised him in so many things, especially this issue of social media. The first lawyer advised him not to come to the social media, not to disclose anything on the social media. But will he do it? Did he do it? No, he didn't do it, and he will not do it. Why? Because he thinks he knows everything. He's the actor. He acts everywhere. He thinks he can skip. He can, you know, skim everything. He can swindle and move out and tell lies and do this and that because he's the son of the Odugu, the lion of Africa. I think, I don't know what enters he said that makes him behave stupidly sometimes. But whatever, this is the situation because he was the one that handed over every evidence that are being used against him now. He was the one that handed the evidence to the lawyers. Because he will go into the social media dancing and peck peck when he says he's not married to her. He will go to the social media to showcase the picking that came out from the skit making. He will go to the social media to be calling her Udogu Ijele, Udogu Ijele, Udogu. When you said you are not married, when you said you are only doing skit making and you are still calling her Ijele Udogu, maybe in a, in a movie they are acting on the social media. So that is the, one of the challenges that uh, this uh, issue now have because everybody knows that you is a stubborn person according to him. He said God created him to be stubborn and that he was called because he's stubborn. And because of his stubbornness, that's why things are moving forward. He thought that stubbornness leads to success. He doesn't know that stubbornness one day can carry someone go quickly. So my people know be smart, you know, and I saw the gist reach us. I said, make I touch light and we turn Remember that this is Niger Celebrity Gist TV, where we touch light better, better gist, my people. Make gonna have a nice day. Bye.